Our next speaker, Representative Lori Jenkins, one of my neighbors in Tacoma. She's from the 27th Legislative District. She was the first out lesbian member of the Washington State Legislature. I have another reason for loving Lori. She's also responsible for the 28th Legislative District, having another out proud lesbian member in Olympia, Christine Kilduff. Yeah. Lori? First things first. I love her hat. Yeah. Welcome to Olympia. Welcome to the People's House in Olympia. You know, our state has a history of leading the way when it comes to expanding civil rights and promoting equality for all people. We were one of the first states in this nation to give women the right to vote. We are the only state in the nation in which voters have twice said women will have the right to choose. They will have control over their own body. It is the people who have done that. And it is the state of Washington and the voters of Washington who said we will have marriage equality for everyone in this state. Our state's anti-discrimination law was passed, passed a full 15 years between before the National Civil Rights Act. We have been leaders in this state on civil rights issues and we will not go back in Washington. We will not go backwards on the gains we've made. We will go forward. And yesterday, when a page within hours of the inauguration, when pages related to LGBT civil rights and the environment and so many other things were stripped from the White House's websites, we, we felt that pain. But you know what? You can erase a website, but you cannot erase people. We are here. We are here and we are not going away. And we will stand strong together forever. Forever. There may be uncertainty about the next four years, but women and communities of color and immigrants and refugee, refugee populations, the LGBT community especially, our trans community, we need to stand together. We need to stand together. We must stand up for the rights and for the dignity of all people. And so, when one of us is attacked, we must become that. I will become a Muslim. I will become transgender. I will become queer, even though I already am. I will be a woman. I will be black. I will be proud. We must find ways to stand together. I will use every tool that I can to fight against a Muslim registry, but if one comes, I will register. I, I will use every tool I have to make sure that our trans brothers and sisters are not discriminated against. But if that happens, I will become one of them and one with them. I will fight against the targeting, the targeting of our immigrant community. And if that community is targeted, if our community is targeted, I will become an immigrant. And I will find ways to do that. And I urge you to find ways to do that. I will do this. I will do this because we are not supposed to just bandage the wounds of victims tossed beneath, beneath the wheels of injustice. We are here to drive a spoke into the wheel itself. Dr. King told us and warned us that we would be judged not for the acts of bad people, but for the silence of the good. You have taken the first step. We have all taken the first step today to make sure that we are not silent good people. But I urge you 
to not just speak out, but to find ways to act. I always love the passion that we get from Lori Jenkins. Thank you.